Look up in the tree, as high as you can see. They live inside the snuggery. The fairies. The golden fairy harmony and rhapsody, her friend. At the bottom of the garden, the fairies. When little girls and boys are born all around the world, a fairy is born for every girl and elf for every boy. We're, We're the, the fairies. fairies. I'm Harmony. And I'm Rhapsody. I'm the Golden Fairy and gold is my favourite colour. And they call me Rainbow Rhapsody because my dress is all the colours of the rainbow. We live in a snuggery high up in the top of the old gum tree. The snuggery is a cosy little hollowed out room, a bit like your bedroom but a lot smaller. In the daytime we have fun playing in the garden with our two Best friends, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee and Elf the Fairy Cake Maker. And at night time, we curl up inside our snuggery and sleep all night long. Except when we have Tooth Fairy Business Rhapsody. Then we stay up really late when the moon and the stars are shining in the sky. Hey Harmony, why don't we sing our special song for the boys and girls? Great idea. You know, the one just about us. <laughs> In the old gum tree at the bottom of the garden In a hole of snuggery We giggle and laugh together We love to have friends over You know, we're really lucky because one day a special fairy friend gave Harmony some magic that can make us big and small. So now, whenever we want to play in the garden like big people, all we have to do is say our special magic rhyme. Tigger, jigger, rimini, digger, magic one, please make us... Wait, Harmony. I can hear somebody. Well, don't make us big now or they might see us. We might even see some today. Fairies, I don't believe it. Next you'll be saying there are elves here as well. Well, he doesn't actually live in this garden, William, but Elf the Fairy Cake Maker is Harmony and Rhapsody's special friend and he comes to visit all the time. I'll believe it when I see it. Young William doesn't believe in fairies, yeah. but we'll show him really soon. There's not even a snuggle. You know, William, there are a lot of things you have to imagine and dream about, and sometimes you can't see them, but they're there all the same. I hope the fairies believe in you, or you might miss out when we make the fairy ring. What's a fairy ring, Arabella? If you come with me, you'll see. Now, 
we put some really pretty flowers in a ring like this. And then when we've gone, the fairies come and dance around and around the flowers. And sometimes leave little treats and beautiful little letters to say thank you. That's perfect. Now let's go back into the house and have some lunch. and girls and have a fairy dance. Tigger, jigger, remedy digger, magic wand, please make us bigger. fairy ring. You know, I'd really like to leave something special for Arabella. And her friends William and Emily. Isn't William funny not believing in fairies? I wonder if he'll believe when he finds a special treat in the fairy ring. <laughs> what do you think we should leave them this time, Rhapsody? Hmm, well, it's afternoon tea time, so I think three bowls of the best strawberries. <laughs> oh, fan, very tastic I'm going to need some extra special magic to make the strawberries really sweet and juicy. Mm. I think the magic wand song would be perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> Sing it now, Harmony. Sparkling magic fairy wand, glittering magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand, please make magic now. Well, don't stop, Harmony. Sing another verse, quick. Twinkling magic fairy wand, starry magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand, please make magic now. Well, nearly there, Harmony. Just one more. Shining magic fairy wand, pretty magic fairy wand, special magic fairy wand, please make magic now. It worked! <gasps> Rhapsody, singing has given me a great idea. You know how it's Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday next week? We could have a surprise birthday party and we could ask Arabella and William and Emily. Yes, and we could get the fairy tots and elf tots to do a special dance. And we could have fairy food and pink lemonade. Mm. <gasps> I'll leave an invitation in the fairy ring. Oh, we'd have to make the three of them little like us too. Oh, there's so much planning to do. Well, let's get little and get going. <gasps> Bittle, fittle, remedy, skittle, magic wand, please make us little. And not only treats, they've left us a fairy note. Quick, let's read it. Is it really from the fairies? It's very small writing. Can you read it? It says, We are all invited to a fairy party in three sleeps' time for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday. Wow, we've been invited to a fairy party. It says, If we want to go, we have to wait in the lounge room next to the open fire and the fairies will come and collect us. And they'll make us fairy small so we can go with them to fairyland at the bottom of the garden. Rhapsody, you know how it's Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday next week? Yes, Harmony. And you know how we're organising an extra special birthday party for <laughs> Barnaby? Yes, Harmony. 
I'd like to make him a really lovely birthday cake. But I don't know how. Hmm. I wonder if you asked Elf the fairy cake maker. He might show you how to make a cake. I think he might. After we've helped Barnaby collect some sweet nectar for his yummy runny honey, we'll go and ask Elf. Harmony, Rhapsody. I think that's Barnaby coming now. Harmony, Rhapsody. Hello, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. Hello, Harmony. Are you two ready to collect some sweet nectar to make some yummy runny honey? You know, I think I'm in the mood to play a game. And my very favourite fairy game is peekaboo. Harmony's a bit of a fusspot and doesn't like being late, but I don't think she'll mind if I play. Rhapsody and I were saying this morning how much we'd love some of your runny, scrummy honey. Where is Rhapsody? Oh, no. Rhapsody's peekabooing. Oh, no, not again. That little fairy is playing. She's picked up the wing again. She hides behind trees, then she jumps out. She hides behind bushes and then gives a shout. Peekaboo's great, but it's time to go out. I'm peekabooing again. Where is she? I'm here. She's where? She's there. She's tricky, she's quirky, she's really good fun. I'm peekabooing again. Rhapsody's being quite tricky. She knows that I'm waiting to go. It's time we were flying, now we'll be late. And being late gets me in a state. Can't go on my own, so I'll have to wait. She's peekabooing again. Harmony. A fuss pot. She likes to be always on time. But peekabooing is such fun to do. I'll hide behind here and I'll hide in there too. When she comes close, I'll jump up and say, Boo! Ah! She's peekabooing again. Where is she? I'm here. She's where? She's there. She's tricky, she's quirky, she's, she's really good. good. Booing again. She's tricky, she's quirky, she's really good fun. She's peekabooing again. Gosh, I do love peekabooing. <laughs> Rhapsody, where's your magic wand? Don't tell me you've lost it. Oh no, I must have dropped it while I was peekabooing. Oh, whatever am I going to do without it? <laughs> If I don't find my magic wand, I can't help Harmony make the special magic we need to collect everything for Barnaby's birthday party. Oh, please, everyone, you've got to help me find it. Don't worry, Rhapsody, we'll find it. Now, you look in that side of the garden, and Harmony, you look in that side of the garden, and I'll go and look behind the tree. if you use your wand to make a magic fairy spell that brings my wand back to me. That's a great idea, Rhapsody. Let's see. Flowers, trees, birds and shells make Rhapsody's wand sound like... tinkling bells. I can hear it. It's over there. No, no, no. It's coming from over here. I, I think it's over here. Everybody, shh. Let's listen quietly. We found your magic wand. We thought that it had gone. It tinkled loud and clear for all of us to hear. It was your magic spell. It worked so very well. Thanks for your help. 
help my friends, I won't lose it again. Gosh, thanks everyone. I was worried there for a while. Well, I think now it's time to help Barnaby collect some sweet nectar for your runny, scrummy, <laughs> yummy honey. <laughs> and then I'm going to go to the snuggery for a fairy nap. I'm feeling really tired. Well, the sooner we collect the nectar, the sooner you can have your fairy nap. <laughs> Come on everyone, let's go! Oh, I just love it when you first wake up from a fairy nap and your head is still full of sleepy dreams. Hello, Rhapsody. Did you have a lovely fairy nap? No, not really. What's up, little fairy? Have you got the grumbles? Oh, I don't know, Harmony. I'm just not feeling very happy. Perhaps Rhapsody fell into a grumble bush while we were collecting sweet nectar for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. I heard that, Harmony. No, I did not fall into a grumble bush. Oh, well, what's wrong, little fairy? The sun is shining, the birds are singing in the trees. It's too nice a day for fairies to have the grumbles. Oh, I'm grumbly because I'm still tired. I was so excited after we found my magic wand and it was such fun collecting sweet nectar that I just couldn't sleep. Oh, I really wanted a fairy nap, but my wings just kept wiggling and my eyes just wouldn't stay shut. And now I'm so grumbly, I don't think I'm going to be able to fly. That's okay, Rhapsody. I'll magic you to the top of the flower pot. I'm sure you'll feel better there. What do you think will get rid of Rhapsody's grumbles? What do you do when you've got the grumbles? You think I should sing a song? A funny song with silly words? Okay, let's give it a try. A funny song with silly words. Thanks, Harmony. That was a very silly song. I'm feeling a little bit better now. <laughs> look, look who's here. Fairies. Guess what? I just made some magic fairy cakes. <laughs> Hi, Elf the Fairy Cake Maker. I think you've come at just the right time. Rhapsody's got the grumbles. I sung her a really silly song and nearly chased all her grumbles away. Perhaps your magic fairy cakes will do the rest. Yeah, mm. and I used all the sweet nectar you helped me collect to make some extra fresh grumbles runny honey to drizzle all over the cakes. Mmm, these fairy cakes are really good, Elf, and the runny honey is really scrummy. What a clever, busy, buzzy bee you are, Barnaby. And Elf, you're the best fairy cake maker I've ever met. 
I think your cakes have nearly chased her grumbles away. I know, everybody. Why don't we sing a song and sing it out really loudly and perhaps it'll chase the rest of Rhapsody's grumbles away completely. <laughs> Which song do you think we should sing? Oh, can we sing at the bottom of the garden, everyone? Please, please, please? <laughs> song everyone and my grumbles have completely gone now in fact I'm in such a good mood I think I'll head to the bottom of the garden and see if I can find the fairy tots and elf tots bye, bye. Rhapsody oh Rhapsody's a funny fairy I'm glad her grumbles have gone it's such a lovely day in the bottom of the garden it's a fan fairy tastic day to be a fairy in the bottom of the garden. And it's a great day to be a busy, buzzy bee in the bottom of the garden as well. And it's a really great day to be an elf at the bottom of the garden. Day song. It makes me feel such a happy, busy, buzzy <laughs> bee. That's because you are a busy, buzzy bee, Barnaby. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I think, really think we should get going. I've got cakes to bake. And I've got honey to make. Well, I'm going to wait here for Rhapsody. She should be back any minute now. Okay. Bye. 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 How many? How many? Oh, Harmony, the elf tots and fairy tots are so excited about Barnaby's birthday party and they've promised not to tell Barnaby. 
Oh, I do hope Elf will help me make a special birthday cake mm. for Barnaby's birthday party. <gasps> hmm. I wonder if we made up a special song about Elf, especially for him, I wonder whether then he'd show you how to make a cake. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great idea. Hmm. Let's make one up now. Okay. <laughs> That's great. He'll just love it. Let's give him a call, shall we? Okay. Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three. Elf the fairy cake maker. Oh, I don't think he heard us. Let's do it again a bit louder this time. Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three. Elf the fairy cake maker. Hmm. No, no. I think we're going to need some extra help. Do you think you could help us call out really loudly? Oh, yes, please, everyone, really loudly. On the count of fairy three, are you ready? Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three. Elf the fairy cake maker! It worked! I can hear his elfy footsteps. Well, quick, let's get ready to sing. <laughs> just the best song. No one sung a song just about me before. That's made me feel so happy. I think I have to make some more fairy cakes. <gasps> oh, Elf, Elf, can I come too? I want to make an extra special cake for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday next week, and I need your help. Well, I don't know, Harmony. You'd, you'd have to stick to my extra, extra special magic elf recipe. I will, Elf, I will. Uh, well, okay. <laughs> we'll make a fabulous cake, Harmony. I think I'll go and give the snuggery a spring clean. <laughs> See Bye. you later. Now, cooking is a very important job, Harmony. You have to be really careful of um, sharp knives. Yes, Elf. And uh, things cooking on the stove. Yes, Elf. But most importantly... Yes? Incredibly importantly... Yes. You have to sing while you cook. Let's break the eggs into the bowl. Then a cup of sugar and some flour. Mix it all around nice and slow, slow, slow. Then add a bit of milk and diddly do do do
little fairy friend. You don't look very happy. Aren't you feeling very well? No. Ever since we ate that plate of fairy cakes and drank all that pink lemonade, I've been feeling a bit sick. Oh, well, this sounds like a job for the doctor. He'll know what to do. Magic fairy wand, so dear, please make the fairy phone appear. Oh, hi, Elf. It's Rhapsody speaking. Can you please put on your doctor's voice? Thanks. <clears throat> oh, hi, Doctor. This is Rhapsody speaking from the bottom of the garden. Oh, I'm fine, thank you. It's my friend Harmony. She's not feeling very well. I was wondering whether you could pay us a fairy doctor visit next to the old gum tree. In two minutes? Thanks, that's great, Elf. I mean, Doctor. We'll see you soon. Bye. Harmony, he said he'd be here in two minutes. <laughs> well, I'll go and get you some fresh water in some fairy cups. That'll make you feel better. <laughs> Thanks, Rhapsody. Hi. <clears throat> Hi, Harmony. What seems to be the problem? Hello, Doctor. Well, it's only since Rhapsody and I shared a plate of fairy cakes and then I drank three glasses of pink lemonade and since then my tummy's been all grumbly like it's being stirred around and around and around and I don't want to feel sick anymore I want to get better hmm I think we better have the doctor's song while I find out what's wrong I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor for the sick. Fixing patients, fixing patients, fixing patients really quick. Check the throat, check the eyes, check the pulse and the ears. Check the temperature, check the reflex, check the wings and wipe the tears. I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor for the sick. Fixing patients, fixing patients, fixing patients really quick. Check the throat, check the eyes, check the pulse and the ears. Check the temperature, check the reflex, check the wings and wipe the tears. Throat is normal, ears are perfect, and the temperature is good. It's quite easy to see the problem. Too much drink and too much food. I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor for the sick. Fixing patients, fixing patients, fixing patients really quick. Well, Harmony, you've got too many sickness. Too many sickness? Too many sickness. The doctor? What is too many sickness? Too many sickness is when little fairies eat too many pieces of fairy bread and too many cakes and too many drinks of pink lemonade. Oh dear. But doctor, how do I get better? Well, Harmony, there's a simple remedy. First, you have to pat your head three times, then rub your tummy like this. I can do that, doctor. Then. You have to stand on one leg and hop, like I'm doing. I can do that too. And then you have to sing the All Better Now song, then go to bed and sleep all night long. Doctor, I can do all those things, but I'd really like Rhapsody's help singing the song. Rhapsody! Here you go, Harmony. This will make you feel better. Oh, thanks, Rhapsody. That was lovely. Rhapsody? Doctors said I should sing a special song to make me feel all better now. Oh, that's a good idea. Would you help me dance? Oh, I'd love to dance for you, Harmony. <laughs>
That's not the fairy, Doctor. You're Elf the Fairy Cake Maker, pretending to be the fairy, Doctor. I may be Elf the Fairy Cake Maker, but I'm a pretty good pretend doctor as well. <laughs> Don't you feel better, Harmony? I do. In fact, I feel so good, I'm sure I'm going to be just fine for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's surprise birthday party. But right now, I'm feeling a bit tired, so I think I'd better go up to the snuggery and sleep all night long. Are you coming, Rhapsody? Oh, yes, it's been a long day, Harmony. It's time for us to go to our snuggery and curl up and sleep all night long and have lots of sleepy fairy dreams. <laughs> Harmony Rhapsody Oh, it's no use calling them on my own. The fairies are tucked up in their snuggery warm and tight, and they're probably still in the land of sleepy dreams. I know. Perhaps all you boys and girls at home could help me call them. Are you ready? Buzzy one, buzzy two, buzzy three. Harmony, Rhapsody. No, 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 no. We're going to have to call out a lot louder than that. Will you help me again? Come on. Buzzy one, buzzy two, buzzy three. Harmony, Rhapsody. Oh, dear. Come on, come on. Hello, Barnaby. Do you want to speak to us? Ah, oh, hello fairies. I need to speak to you now. It's really important. Can you come down? Do you suppose he's found out about the birthday party that we're organising for him? We should go down and find out what he wants. Good morning, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. You're up bright and early this morning. Oh, Harmony Rafferty, quick, quick, quick. You've got to hurry. You've got work to do. Well, slow down, Barnaby. You're buzzing around like a busy, buzzy bee. Well, I am a busy, buzzy bee. And anyway, I can't slow down. I'm too excited. I have made an important discovery. Arabella has lost another tooth. Oh, my special fairy child has lost another tooth. <laughs> You're right. That's incredibly exciting. fan fairy tastic in fact. I'll have to call Tilly the Tooth Fairy on the magic fairy phone and see if she'll come tonight and swap Arabella's tooth for a shining gold coin. <laughs> magic fairy wand so dear, please, please make, make the, the fairy, fairy phone appear. appear. Hello, Tilly the Tooth Fairy. It's Harmony speaking from the bottom of the garden. Good, thank you. Tilly the Tooth Fairy, my special fairy child, Arabella, has lost another tooth. We're wondering if you could come to the bottom of the garden and swap her tooth for a shining gold coin. Tonight, 8 o'clock, at the bottom of the garden. <gasps> fan fairy -tastic. We'll see you then. <laughs> oh, it'll be great to see Tilly the Tooth Fairy. I haven't seen her for ages. Hey, Barnaby, would you like to join us tonight when we swap Arabella's tooth for a sparkling gold coin? After all, it was you that discovered Arabella's tooth. <laughs> oh, that would be just amazing. I haven't seen Tilly the Tooth Fairy for ages. Oh, I can't wait for tonight. <laughs> Let's go, then. I can see her. I can see Tilly the Tooth Fairy. Oh, doesn't she just look fan fairy tastic at night? Hello, Harmony. Hello, Rhapsody. Hello, Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee. And how are all my bottom of the garden friends tonight? Hello, Hello Tilly, Tilly the, the Tooth, Tooth fairy. fairy. We're fan fairy tastic. Isn't it exciting? My fairy child, Arabella, losing another tooth. I know, Harmony. It is exciting. Lots of children have lost their teeth today, and I've got lots of gold coins to magic up, so we'd better get flying. In the land of sleepy dreams, you can dream. Sprinkles through 
Special tooth pot harmony. All I have to do is make some tooth fairy magic and turn her tooth into a shining gold coin. One shining gold coin for your fairy child, Harmony. Won't you be just delighted when she wakes up in the morning? I'm so glad I came to the I'm so excited. I don't think I'm going to sleep a wink tonight. Well, we'd better go before we wake up Arabella, and then she'd be so excited she wouldn't sleep a wink. Good night, Arabella. Good night, Arabella. Good night, Arabella. It's time for sleepy dreams. Thanks for magicking up the special gold coin, Tilly the Tooth Fairy. I wish I could see Arabella's face in the morning when she discovers that the Tooth Fairy has swapped her tooth for a shining gold coin. Anytime, Harmony and Rhapsody. See you soon. Oh, I'm feeling really tired. I think it's time for my sleepy dreams now. I think I'll join you in the snuggery, Rhapsody. Good night, Barnaby. Good night, Barnaby. Good night, fairies. See you in the morning. Good morning, Rhapsody. Did you have a lovely sleep? Oh, good morning, Harmony. After all the excitement of meeting Tilly the Tooth Fairy and flying up to Arabella's bedroom, I had some really fabulous dreams. I dreamt that it was Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday party and all the elf tots and fairy tots were there and they danced and sang and Arabella came with her friends Emily and William. That wasn't a dream, you funny rainbow rhapsody. 
That's what's really happening. <gasps> Today is Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's birthday, and we are having a party for him in the bottom of the garden. And the elf tots and fairy tots are singing and dancing, and Arabella and William and Emily are coming. Oh, gosh, we'd better get flying and get organising. <laughs> Well, Rhapsody, the first thing we need is a table to put all of the food on for Barnaby's special birthday. OK. Magic fairy one so able, please help us with a party table. <gasps> <laughs> all done, Harmony. What next? Man, fairy tastic Rhapsody. The next thing we need is some food for the birthday party. <laughs> Let's see now. We need the special cake that Elf the Fairy Cake Maker helped me to bake. We need... Chocolate crackles, marshmallows, and fairy bread. Mm. And also, Rhapsody, we need some really lovely fresh fruit for the table. Oh, gosh, this is going to be some party, Harmony. <laughs> Magic fairy wand so sweet, please help us with some food to eat. <gasps> <gasps> oh, yum. Oh, Rhapsody. Rhapsody, I can hear someone. Oh, no, it's Barnaby. Oh, no. If Barnaby sees this food, he won't be surprised. Quick, Rhapsody, make it all invisible. Magic fairy wand of mine, if Barnaby sees us, he won't be surprised. Make everything partyish go away before Barnaby gets here. Please hurry, I say. Goodness me, oh goodness me. I thought I heard the fairies a few seconds ago. <laughs> it must have been the birds and the butterflies twittering away. Well, I never. Whew, that was close, Harmony. Oh, it sure was, Rhapsody. Oh, no. Who's that I can hear now? Oh, don't worry. That sounds like the fairy tots and elf tots to me. <laughs> Hello, Hello, Elf Tots and Fairy Tots. Hello, Harmony. Hello, Rhapsody. <laughs> We're all ready for Barnaby's birthday party. <gasps> oh, you gorgeous little tots. You're going to make such wonderful big fairies and big elves when you get bigger. Hi, Harmony. <laughs> Hi, Rhapsody. Arabella and her friends are waiting on the lounge where you told them to. Is it time to get them yet? It is time to get them. Yes, let's surprise them. I can't wait to see William's face when he sees us. <laughs> Silly old bear, he said. What were you doing? First you went... Hello, Arabella, my little fairy child. You look very pretty in your party dress. Are you ready to become very small and come with us? Hello, Harmony, my own special fairy. Hello, Rhapsody. Fairies, this is William and this is Emily. Hello, William and Emily. Hello, Hello, fairies. I told you they were real. We're ready to become fairy small. In fact, we've been ready since yesterday. And we've been learning a song for Barnaby's birthday. That sounds fan fairy tastic. We'd better get little and get going. Close your eyes really tightly. Bittle, fittle, remini, skittle, magic wand, make the children little. We're so small. Wow. We're nearly ready for Barnaby the Busy Buzzy Bee's surprise birthday party. Do you want to join us in the bottom of the garden in Fairyland? You do? Well then put on your fairy wings and put on your elf wings and come with us. <laughs> and now it's time to call the birthday bee. Now we all need to call his name out together, okay? After the count of three. Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three. Barnaby the busy buzzy bee. Oh, he must be a long way away. I think we need help from the children at home. Can you call Barnaby's name too? Well, come on, let's all try it all together this time. You ready? Fairy one, fairy two, fairy three. Barnaby the busy buzzy bee. <laughs> Rhapsody. What's happening? What, what, what? <laughs> hey, 
everybody, let's say happy birthday to Barnaby. Happy birthday, Barnaby, the fizzy buzzy bee. <laughs> Barnaby, it's your birthday. And Arabella and Emily from the top of the garden have made up a special birthday rap song. So go and sit down and they'll sing it to you. <laughs> Tots and Elf Tots have a surprise for you, Barnaby. Really? <laughs> They're going to sing you the When You're Happy and You Know It song. Oh, come on, that's Tots. one of my come favourite on, Tots. songs. Come Do you like it? it? Oh, I love it. Oh, You're going to love this, oh, Barnaby. I will, I know. <laughs> Everybody, everybody, I think it's time to eat. Yay! <laughs> Everybody, 
All good things have to finish sometime, don't they? And I guess that it's best they all finish while we're having a really good time. And tonight when we go to bed, we can all dream about the party. <laughs> How about we sing the goodbye song to all the boys and girls at home and we can dance the goodbye dance? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Okay, let's go, everybody. <laughs> Goodbye to all our friends, it's sad that we must go. We've had a lovely time today, we've had some funny laughs today, we've made some special friends today, and now we have to go. We A busy buzzy wave and a busy buzzy wiggle A busy buzzy kiss and a busy buzzy giggle Goodbye from me, the busy buzzy bee Now I have to go Bye. 